Welcome to this Windows 8 channel and uh, I've had a few requests for this one and I'm going to actually do it and we're going to call it a little bit uh, back to the basics once again. Uh, how to transfer files between one folder to another or a thumb drive to another uh, folder or so on but by using the drag uh, and drop. So to do that you need to have two windows open at the same time so you can drag and drop from a place to another uh, depending on what you want to do. So how does it work? Let's say I want to drop um, a video or a file that I have on my desktop into my USB thumb drive. What I could do is simply go to the file explorer and on the left side I would click uh, my thumb drive so that I could view my thumb drive actually right here. Now you see that it's open now. So I'll just click on the top edge of the window as you see with my mouse pointer and I could by holding um, the button and moving the mouse I can move the window around so that it doesn't hide the files that I want to drop. Now let's say I want to drop this video file here into my thumb drive. You know, as you see at the top, it does say this PC Kingston F. What is written here at the top in the address bar is the location of this window right now. So I'll click and hold and I'll just slide. And here it says copy to Kingston F. You just release the mouse button. And you'll see a progression go by, as you see now, where it's going to drop that file into my USB key. Now let's say you want to drop or drag and drop um, two files. So you want to drag and drop two files from different folders. Now let's see, um, I have one spot that I'll go to. So for example, if I want to take um, images that are from my or anything. Let's say I want to use my music folder here and I want to transfer uh, here, I've got a folder called Eurythmics Ultimate. And I want to transfer that to my USB key. Now, you could, of course, when you have the um, left pane open, uh, you can, of course, just, you know, click on it and just drop it directly here. But um, you can also just, you know, open a second window. So, for example, I'll click here the file explorer and open uh, the file explorer, a second file explorer as you see here. So I've got two windows open as you can see on the same screen. I'll simply click on Kingston for example here at the bottom and now I have two windows. One that says that I'm in the music library in Eurit and I, can, I will want to transfer Eurythmics Ultimate and this is my Kingston window and I'll want of course to send it there so I'll simply click the folder and slide it into my Kingston drive. Um, one thing that you might want to know because sometimes when you open windows they're got full screen and you're like how do I get these windows to you know have the size that I want so I can put them side by side. Make sure that you have that you know this little minimize button but at, in the middle you have uh, first you have minimize but then you have one right there in the middle between the closing a window and minimize which is simply changing the size of a window it will create a smaller window which is not full screen and by the edges by the way if you go you see that your mouse pointer in any edges becomes a double pointer. That means that if you click here and move your mouse while you're holding your mouse button, you can resize the window as you wish. So you can actually put these windows just big enough so that they are correctly displayed side by side. So I'm going to click this one, I'm going to resize it by the corner so it resize both and you see here that I have two windows side by side. So now I can actually uh, just, you know, drag, drag and drop from one to the other. All I have to do is simply go to 
uh, you know, the folder that you want to transfer something to, open it in a window, go to the folder where the object or the file or the folders are, put them side by side. You can open as many file explorer windows as you want. So if you want to have another one, you can right click in the file explorer and just click file explorer to have a third one. So you see here you can open many different locations and drag and drop in between these locations. So it's as easy as that. So that's another way you can transfer files and folders from one spot to the other in your computer. If you enjoy our videos, why not subscribe to our channel? You'll be informed when new videos are online. If you have any comments or questions on what you've seen, maybe you have a question or something that you'd like us to make a video of, let us know. We'll try to post that video online. Thank you for watching.